Football championship continues today, ESPN2. Regional coverage of the first round, either Hartford, Yukon, Vanderbilt, Louisville, Gardner, Webb, Miami, or St. Francis meets Maryland. Well, once again, Union opened up Division I play in 1991, just 6-43-1. After two years of Division I play, there were some skeptics in Schenectady, but now, for the first time, they are going to the NCAA Division I. Hockey Championships. Their head coach is Nate Lehman. He joins us now. Great crowd behind him in Schenectady. And coach, explain the important factors in getting Union to this point, from D3 to struggling in D1 to now to make the big dance. What have been the important factors in your time there? Well, really, just uh, it's about recruiting the right young men. Uh, we're fortunate that we have a great institution here, a great academic institution that attracts, you know, high quality, high character young men. So, um, you know, really, it's about uh, what we've recruited, how we've recruited, and and uh, and kind of building step by step that way. Mm. Now, this your regional is a power play regional. All four teams, excellent power plays. Uh, why is your power play so good? Well, I think we. I think it starts. We have ten uh, good players that share the puck and like to control the pace of the power play. Um, you know, we definitely have a couple finishers in there with Wayne Simpson and Dan Carr. But um, you know, I think we have we have pretty good chemistry. We've kept the, the same ten guys together all season long. And you know, the big thing is we have to outwork our opponent and control the pace of the play when we're on the power play. Yale is the number one overall seed in the tournament. I know you play them. Talk about uh, the strengths of this team. Well, I mean, I think, uh, you know, we don't want to look past Duluth by any means. Of I mean, course. Duluth has is, is got a great set of forwards, and, uh, you know, and I think Yale has a, a great set of forwards as well. I think there's a lot of similarities between Duluth and Yale, uh, but right now our focus is, is uh, starting right now. It's going to be all about Duluth. We know they're, they're going to be a hungry team getting knocked out of their, uh, their conference play a little early. All right, eighth season in Yale for Nate Lehman. Good luck in the tournament, Nate. Thanks, guys. Thanks for having me. So a great crowd, great story there in Union. Okay, boys, we have 16 teams. We start with the Sweet 16 in hockey. We know how this party works. Uh, Barry, start with you. As you look at it in the field, what, how's it going to play out in your mind? I think the best team, the most talented team is North Dakota. I, I think they're giants. I think they're great skaters. And they've got Pratt and the best player in college hockey. And I like Yale. I, I've done a lot of the Yale games. They're a bunch of smarties. Uh, they're very smart. They've got good uh, special teams. And if Rondo gives them good goaltending, I think they're capable of beating anybody. What do you think, Sean? I think it's going to be a BC Miami final, and you're going to see uh, BC win their second title in a row with John Muse and Nettie. He hasn't lost the game yet, and he's a super talent. And this team's loaded offensively, and they're, I don't know if anyone can keep up with them mm -hmm. with the speed. That would be three national championships in four years. And what about the Hobie Baker? It seems like it's coming down to Fratton and Mealy. What do you like? Andy Mealy, best one on one player in college hockey.